Welcome back, everybody. We're going to try something different on the channel today. We're going to do a little bit of a Let's Play video. And we are going to be playing Aliens Dark Descent. And this game is a real-time strategy where you command a squad of hardened colonial marines to stop a terrifying terrifying xenomorph outbreak on planet Lethe. So this game is kind of a real-time strategy, but you command a squad instead of individual units. And the reason it really jumped into me was because I love Dawn of War 2, where you command squads of space marines and you get to customize those space marines. But it's not too finicky in the sense of, you Please know... Please be mindful of docking bay protocol at all times. Absolutely. Always be mindful of docking bay protocol. Wayland, Utah. Building better worlds. I mean, that's a pretty iconic suit, but I always think, like, wouldn't a forklift just be more convenient? I don't know. I wonder what's in that giant blinking coffin. <laughs> Nothing dangerous could possibly be in there. Wayland Yutani would never be up to any shady business. All vessels, be advised. Due to local storms, we currently have no contact with Lethe. Just hold tight until planet fall. We'll guide you as long as we're in range. They really have captured. Oh, They really have captured the uh, aliens aesthetic. I love it. Oof. It's always the guy with scars on his faces. Who would hire that guy? He looks shifty as hell. Please enter your 29,000 digit path code. <laughs> oh, that looked like it failed. Well. I wonder what's inside. That is such a cool animation though. Rut row. <laughs> That's so cool. It's the scale. Yeah, that's so cool. Something's up with that container. Any news from Lisa Hayes? Sorry, sir. We're having a hard time reaching anyone. That storm probably... Damn. Must be one hell of a hurricane to cut us from the whole planet. Chief Administrator, I'm showing a weight discrepancy on the Bentonville's manifest. They just asked for a takeoff accreditation, but half the shipment is still at dock. Half, you say? Well, we just earned a bonus. I'll allow them to take off right away. Protocol dictates... How many times? Company protocol doesn't mean anything out here. What works, works. And we're already behind schedule. Director Price... Isn't here. And if I do recall correctly, Deputy Administrator Hayes, your shift ended half an hour ago. So get the hell off my command deck and let me do my job. 
Why his face looks weird? Like, she looks like a normal human. He looks like some sort of puppet. I don't care what McDonald says. Something is wrong here. I can monitor the cargo bay camera's security feed just as well from my office. Yeah, you can. All right. Normal standard stuff. W, A, S, and D. Q, and E. Love it. Look at the detail. Just love this game. It's so cool. All right. During a mission, you will have to complete several objectives in order to advance the story. Later, secondary objectives can com be completed to recover hidden resources and additional information about the location. These objectives are indicated in the top left of my screen. So you click up here and you follow the objective indicator. I can, I can do that. Let's do it. All right. Right click to remove. Easy, easy. Doors automatically open. I like it. I like it. Let's keep going, shall we? Now. Okay, we're moving down the corridors. You look troubled, Administrator. Is there anything I can do? To help? <laughs> Thank you, Daniel. But no, I'm just having one of those days, you know. Another argument with Administrator McDonald. How did you guess? I may be synthetic, but I'm not blind. Is his mouth supposed to Are move? You sure, I can't be of assistance. No, it's my problem, and I'll take care of it. I just need to reach my office. Of course. But I'm afraid this corridor is closed due to maintenance. You'll need to detour through the cafeteria. Oh my god. Those guys are definitely trouble. <laughs> I heard no one's picking up on the planet. Not even Jackson's landing. Really? I have a friend there. I hope he's okay. Let's eavesdrop on these dudes. <sighs> these bloody storms, man. These bloody storms. That doesn't sound like something a guy with an American accent would say. I mean, no offense to Americans, but I just don't think they say the word bloody. Poor dialogue. Six out of ten. Don't often see you in here, Administrator Hayes. Are you lost? Do you need me to show you to your room? Last I checked, you couldn't find your own ass with both hands. I'll pass. <laughs> Ooh, snap! that guy in his place what's going on over here are these two just chilling any other like secret dialogue lines that i haven't heard before okay Supply let's try shuttle bentonville secure for launch all crews this is your two minute warning shit need to hurry let's go so the double double click is is to run i wish there was a button that you could follow like the person Office reach, you're in your office, check the camera. So you can select objects with your left mouse click, and then you just do your bits. Welcome, Administrator Hayes. Ruh -roh. Okay, well that doesn't look good. I just noticed her cheekbones are really, like, square. Well, what the hell's going on down there? I'll have to take a closer look. I have a decent guess at what's going on down there. Let's reach the elevator, shall we? Oh, which way are we going? We're going back this way. Let's let's just keep going the way we're going. I'm not actually sure if this is the right way or not. Nope, it is. Let's go. What's going on, guys? Where's Chief Durant? Selling the labor dispute on a rally. Then you'll have to do. Gather a security team and come with me. <laughs> Not a chance. McDonald just linked in. Told us you'd be stirring up trouble. Again. I ain't getting involved. Take it up with him. Thanks for nothing. <laughs> Thanks for nothing. All right, let's go to the docking bay, shall we? Objective complete. <laughs> the objective was to take the elevator. Love it. Before, before. What is the quickest way there? Oh, the map, baby. Let's have a look at the map, shall we? All right. Uh, map is not really. Oh, there we go. We've, we've popped in now. So we need to head left, go straight, and through there, and come there. Right, we get it. Uh, reach the cargo bay map object on the left of the map screen all the missions object active objectives are displayed current objectives can be selected by pressing 
left click on the objective list or by directly seeking the objective icon on the map. On the top right of the map, all the floors to make up the location are displayed. The floor that you wish to display can be selected by pressing that on the list, on the icon. Okay, cool. Click the back button to close the map interface. Let's do that, shall we? So let's let's head over this way, shall we? Those fucking storage hoppers in Patriot. Oh. Supply shuttle Bentonville is cleared for launch. Uh, Remember, all unauthorized breaks taken by non-officer grades will automatically be deducted from leave allowance. <laughs> I should work in from Wayland, you tiny. How crappy. Landing pod four, we're here. Let's go. Oh, well. He doesn't look in a, in a, in a great space. You're going to be all right. Cargo bay. These things came out of... Stay with me, stay... You need to see what's in there. Yeah. Take the gun. Better safe than sorry. Oh. Better take his pistol. No, whatever's in there doesn't know I can't aim for shit. <laughs> uh oh. Seems like it came from the platform. Get a closer look. Investigate the cargo bay. That's the Bentonville. Okay, so you use your left click mouse button to like hover stuff. Oh, well, yeah, not, yeah. I know what they were holding in these things, but you're going to have to find out the hard way, unfortunately. What is all this? Oh, they opened more than one. I didn't realize that. Wait, does that saliva mean it's coming from the ceiling? <laughs> I love, I love the fear you get when you see those eggs. Uh, oh, shit. oh shit is right. We need to get the hell out of here. Let's go, let's go. I Run. can't that thing run loose. I need to lock this damn door. There's a welder back there. Okay, okay, get the welder, get the welder. Let's go, let's go. Search technician. Time to get it sealed up. Whatever that thing is, can't chew its way through a door. Get it together, Michael. Oh, run! Oh, no. Okay, so then you left click and then you weld. Weld for your life. Oh, that's so cool. That is so cool. the Bensonville. What are you talking about? The dock crew and Cargo Bay 4 are dead. Dead? That's not funny. Look at his face. Something got loose and killed. <gasps> Power failure. Power failure. Engaging emergency generators. What just happened? I don't understand. How did the aliens, like, shut down the electricity? That's a lot. Yeah. Do they, like, actively know where to how to shut off the lights? Oh god, facehuggers are just the, the creepiest things in science fiction. Oh my god. Imagine... Imagine that happening to you. Oh, dear lord. That scared the shit out of me.
Bye, little alien. Shit. Shit. Security. I need to get to security. Let's get some help. Uh, well, let's let's check out our security. Let's use our map. Let's use our map powers. Okay, so it's pretty much straight ahead. Let's get behind so we can see where we're going. Oh, okay. Yeah, you'll be fine, pal. You'll be fine. Just give me, give me a, give me a few minutes. Okay. Well, sorry about that. Not much. What the you hell do is there? happening? Everyone's dying in there. The Bentonville. I can't let that happen. Otago? The Colonial Marines. USS Otago. This is Administrator Hayes. There's some kind of infestation aboard. Otago, you have to intercept the Benhamville before it leaves the system. Can you hear me, Otago? Please copy. Is everything all right? Please copy. Damn it! Comms are down. I can't fix them from here. I need to get to the comms room. All right, comms room is where we need to go back this way, I think, and then this way. Yeah, this looks to be the right way. Oh. Lewis, are you in there? I need access to the comms room. Lewis, answer me, damn it. Go away. You're drawn right to us. Open the damn door. Come on, Lewis. No way. It's staying locked to keep those things out. You think that'll help? Be Get sound. The vents. Vents? <laughs> Well, Lewis, Shit. you okay? Lewis. Hey, buddy. Lewis. Lewis is fine, everyone. Lewis is fine. Don't worry. Alert. Alert. Oh, no. Station integrity compromised. All right. We're going to have to go the long way around by those things. Uh, we just go this way, I suppose. I think. Unless, is this actually a door? Or are we just like, no. It's just a vent. Okay, so let's go back to the drawing board with the maps. We need to get here. How do we get there? How do I get there? Did I? Oh, maybe I have to. Okay, right. Forget what I just did there, everybody. Let's just skip a pass. Let's just skip a past all this. Skip a past. Okay, so we want to go left in here, I think. And we'll head out this way, yeah. Oh, who's this Manning, dude? It's out there. It's waiting for me. Manning, you can't stay here. No, no, I can't see me here. Go away. Go away. <laughs> can't okay. see me. Just keep your head down. Oh. Can't see me here. <laughs> Best of luck, pal. You got this. believe in you all right we're on the way Get for that fire I think we're going in here let's double check before we yeah let's go oh here's our creepy friend Chris, I was say Christopher destroyed our communication system why would they do that they're animals sorry i have no idea i wish i could help you further shit the bentonville i need to stop that ship daniel our planetary quarantine protocols they're still operational aren't they i do believe so deputy administrator what do i do those things have to come from the planet. If even one gets off world. Ugh. No, there's no choice. I could stop them. Deputy Administrator, you're only following the Wayland Yutani containment procedures. The Cerberus protocol was specifically designed for a situation like this. What you're doing is only right. <laughs> right. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Wayland Yutani protocol is, you know, notoriously wholesome and well meaning. 
Okay, so we've got to go this way. We've got to execute the Cerberus protocol. Reach the Cerberus room. Cerberus was the, the many-headed dog that guarded the gates of hell. Anything in games that's got the name Cerberus in it is generally not a good thing. Unless you're playing the game Hades, where Cerberus is actually a very good dog. She is running just as fast as she can. Here we go. We got this. Let's activate Cerberus protocol, shall we? What Warning. could go wrong? Three ships detected. USS Otago, Bentaville, Baldrin. We'll be caught in the high orbit interdiction radius. Please confirm command. I am so sorry. Cerberus protocol activated. Purging contaminant vectors. Stand by. Stand by. Purging contaminant vectors. Basically, you're going to shoot the shit out of them. Missiles are loading. Excellent. Oh, how cool is that? <laughs> as dark as this is, it just looks cool. In space, nobody can hear you get missiled. Well, there's the Benton build on. Everyone else is getting absolutely poked. <laughs> okay. Wait. Are we the bad guys? <laughs> we were the bad guys all along, folks. Trouble. <laughs> That's class. That is class. Run away! Oh. When your squad encounters an enemy while undetected, the enemy will not detect your squad immediately. That makes sense. Detection delay is represented by a yellow line that goes from the enemy to one of your squad members. This line will gradually fill up with red. When that is fully complete, the squad will be detected. Uh, you can avoid being spotted by hiding behind cover. Cover spots are indicated with small green squares on the floor. Press that, press right click and right click to run to the designated area to take cover. Right, so we're going to run there. When behind cover, you can hide by avoiding being... When behind cover, you can hide to avoid being detected. Crouch behind cover using control. Nice, okay. Oh, we're being hunted. Love a girl. Okay, right. So we basically have to just sneaky sneaky our way around the alien. Alright, alright, where is the alien now is the next question. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. She is? He is? And uh, do we just follow oh no how do we know what direction they're facing is it just like can we get up there oh we could have gone up there actually now that i think about it where, where are they gone okay so they're up there let's just follow them soon they won't see us Ooh, get around behind the thing oh god okay we, we're okay that was close 
Right, so they've actually got very good, very good eyes and ears by the looks of things. Oh, that's so close. Ooh, crouch, you silly woman. Can you only crouch when you're... I don't know where they've gone. I honestly don't know where they've gone. Where is the alien gone? Have we lost them? Where's the alien? Right. Oh no! What the absolute hell? Well, guess this is the end, folks. Does anyone else see a dude in a suit? <laughs> oh, look who's here. Come we got on. a badass in here, Come yo. On. Space Marines. Shut that door! Shut that door! We've lost contact with the Otago. Well, that's just great. I'm Sergeant Harper, USCM. You? Hey, uh, Dep Deputy Administrator. You're from the Otago? Yeah. What the hell was that thing? It was... Everyone's dead. It was on one of the cargo shuttles. All right, people. We're falling back to the dropship. Hunslet, we're rolling to you. Copy. Let's go. Squad basics. From now on, the Marine squad will be controlled as a single entity. When you order the squad to perform a task, a Marine from the squad will be automatically assigned to carry it out. Let's go, everybody. We finally got some Marines. Hurrah. Cerberus protocol in effect. What the fuck is a Cerberus protocol? Uh, no, I don't know. Just keep it moving and watch those corners. We don't know. It's it's... quarantine. Nothing in, nothing out. Sounds like a real party. All right, Louise. You sound like a real party. Okay, where are we going? Going straight on. Probably shouldn't be running, but look, let's let's just get this let's just get this done. I imagine because we're kind of technically still in the tutorials, nothing is gonna pop out at us unless it's actually supposed to pop out at us. Are we going in here? Is that the plan? No, oh, did I just go the complete wrong way? I just went the complete wrong way. Unless we're supposed to kind of go this way, and then I just made an absolute... Yeah, we're okay. We're actually supposed to go this way. Uh, we'll go in here, I think, is where we're supposed to go. <clears throat> you okay, Sarge? Eyes ahead. Something's coming. No. Oh. Harper? We've got movement. Oh. God, the motion tracker is so cool. Motion tracker indicates any moving entities within a 60 meter radius with a white dot. Okay. We post up. Do we just keep pretending like nothing's happening? Oh, is it still there? Oh, it is still there. I think it's on the other side of that wall, though. I think we're okay. Probably a cat. <laughs> isn't that... Isn't, oh, it's the other side of that wall there, obviously. That's cool. We're going to go in there now, though, aren't we? Yeah, we're going to go in there. Anything in there that's fun? No. Manning? Where are you going? It's not safe here! Stop. Damn straight, but we'll get you out. No, you don't understand. It's here. It's here. Oh, dear Lord. Light it up. Light it up. Marines are trained to automatically open fire on enemies when detected. Marines will open fire even when walking. When running, Marines can't use any of their weapons. Okay. Oh, still Lights didn't up. kill it. That thing's still out there. All right, so we're going to basically follow it. Let's go. Take him out! Use a grenade! 
Oh, grenades. Your Marines have access to skills that will help them deal with various threats. You can open the skill menu by pressing spacebar. Open the skill menu. Uh, using Select U1 grenade launcher in the skill menu. Yeah, I can do that. Uh, use the one with the Leo's massive damage in an area. Using it consumes one command point. Yeah, let's aim at the designated area. Nice. Command points are a resource that can be spent in order to use skills. Command points are refilled over time until the maximum capacity is reached. You'll be able to raise this maximum later by upgrading your Marines. Okay, so skill points or command points are up here. Regenerate slowly over time. Okay, yeah, nice. So they're they're pretty pretty crucial resource. It looks like. Watch the acid. We need that elevator. Punch it. Punch it. Tracker lighting up. All right. Set for suppressing fire and check your targets. Open the skill menu. We are going to suppress a fire. Marine covers the selected area. Within this area, enemies move at seventy percent of the initial speed. The Marines' firing rate is doubled, but as a counterpart, their accuracy is reduced by 20 points. It needs to be manually cancelled to end. The Marine performing suppressed fire cannot run. Alright, so we're gonna... Getting closer. Closer. Go down Wait here. My order. Steady. 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 Oh. Well, who could have seen this coming? Is that you? Administrator Hayes, where are you going? We're getting to safety, Daniel. Please, come with us. I'm afraid I can't permit that. Cerberus protocols are in effect. <laughs> the background to him is glass. But we can't stay. It's not safe. The protocols are clear. Nothing in, nothing out. I'm sorry, Administrator Hayes. <laughs> Why would it have a setting for its eyes to go red? Bring it down! What the hell was that? I, I don't know. I've never even heard Daniel raise his voice since, man. Creepy little. All right, let's just move on here. Why would, why would they, why would they have a setting that makes his eyes go red? Oh, that's funny. They'd have to build that in. It's like some programmer has to be like, we need an evil mode. Fuck. Incoming. Oh. She's taking a few uh, chomps. Oh, oh no. What? It's blood is some kind of acid. Fuck. What kind of blood type is that? Keep your distance, Marines. Latimer, you fit to move? I'm not dying here. All right, let's get off this damn station. When a xenomorphite dies, there's a chance that it might explode into an acid burst, causing one damage to any nearby marines. Your marines can walk and shoot at the same time, so keep moving in the opposite direction of the xenomorphs that are coming at you. Interest understood. Um, I'm assuming we can heal them. Maybe we haven't triggered that part yet. Mobile, yeah, there we go. I'll break open the med kit. Each Marine has their own health bar. The health bar is composed of the following. Life, represented by health points. So we have life, yeah. See the hovering at the bottom there. Health points. Uh, armor represented by white armor plates. That's fair. And when a Marine's health drops to zero, they will end up in either a critical condition or dead. So we've got the white points, we've got the green, and then we've got their sort of life. Understood. A light wound will be applied to any marine whose health drops to two health points. In this case, your marine has a wound leg, which applies a movement speed penalty. Light wound effects are described in the codex. All right. You select your wounded marine to open the interaction menu for them. Here we got a slight bit of lag for some reason. First aid. Shit. Ah, Ruiz, you're making it worse. Maybe Shut up. Be such a baby. There you go. All right. Pretty, but that ship sailed long ago. Gee, thanks. Nice. All right. So Latimer has no more armor plates by the looks of things. I can't imagine it's going to matter though during this sort of tutorial section. Shit, they're in the walls. They're in the walls. Uh, shotgun. Your marine will have access to a skill that will help them deal with various threats. You can open the skill menu by pressing space bar. Select shotgun blast. Yes, please. Boom. Things are handy. 
For close encounters. Okay. Let's keep moving on, shall we? I have to remember my shotguns and stuff. Like, it's these command points you got to keep track of, it looks like. You know, you got to use command points. So that's one command point, one command point, one command point. We kind of use suppressive fire. Oh, during the tutorial, okay. And then spacebar kind of slows time down. I think you can set that so that it pauses the game as well, but I think the, the uh, slowing time down just kind of makes this game a little bit more action-packed. Hell of a time for a migraine. Seriously, Sarge? What's up with you? Um, oh, no! We're in danger! Something's up with him. He's got some sort of special powers. Harper, pull it together. We have to leave. Yeah, yeah. Well, Hayes being a bitch. Hot evac. All right, all right. Air Hunslet inbound. Have your boarding passes ready. Uh, creatures killed. Evacuation is coming. Get ready. It's now time for you to use everything you've learned in order to survive. Let's use suppressive fire, baby. I'm assuming they're coming. Well, let's figure out what, what direction they're coming from first. What's going on? Why, why is... Oh, I have to... Order Marine to lay suppressive... Oh, okay, right. Sorry, I didn't realize it. Uh, is there a specific way? Shit, from, that way? Contacts. Closing fast. How many of those things are there? Oh, this so seems many. to be quite a lot. Let's make sure... Oh, let's use our grenade launcher. Oh, no. There's no grenade launcher. Oh, did we just, like, shotgun the wall? Boom. Boom. Yeah. Position, Marines. Well, don't worry, Hunslet. There's no rush. It's not like we're all gonna die. There we go. That's much better. We've no. Uh, you open the skill menu. You either activate slow mo or pause the game. This will give you time to use your skills, like the grenade launcher, shotgun blast, with greater use precision. Switch between slow mo and pause. So, yeah. I mean, I think I just used up some of the stuff. We've got no more uh, points left, so ultimately we can't use any of that stuff. Oh no, we've got acid all over us. Okay, maybe the tutorial it doesn't matter. Hopefully the tutorial it doesn't matter. Getting off this ship. Would you look at that? Hell, she's taking a pounding. I wonder what happened there. Otago, this is Harper. Do you copy? Hansel, can you get us aboard? No way, Sarge. Between the debris and the decaying orbit? Death trap. Damn it. Still being Those shot at? Platforms are leaving us alone. They are designed for planetary quarantine. But Lethe has to remain operational. Low orbit is considered safe, but beyond that, it's it's a dead zone. Cerberus will shut down everything attempting to go through in both directions. Cerberus, huh? You seem to know a lot about it. I know everything about it. I'm Pioneer Station. That's my job. Yeah, you know why I decided to turn the Otago into scrap metal? I... I don't know. Systems failure, maybe? You saw the state of the station. Oh, Shit. she's a liar. She we are definitely the bad guys down. in this game. No problem. Fireball like that's hard to miss. I'm loving the cinematics, like, it's very, like, on brand for the genre. Not the genre, the movie. Pull up! Good.
Welcome home, Harper. You like oh. what I've done with the place? We need some Martinez. textures, please. It's good to see you, Sarge. Sergeant Martinez, is it is your communication system working? It's online, but we're only picking up static. These yeah. colonies. We need we need some textures, please. But who's asking? Meet Deputy Administrator Hayes from Pioneer. Where's Captain Cochran? There's shit going down on that station like you wouldn't believe. Gone. The whole command staff's gone. You're it. Me? Uh, you made sergeant before I did. You've got seniority. Yeah, sure, but these are the captain's orders, as in the deathbed kind. So this shit's all yours. He insisted. If you want me, I'll be in the armory, seeing what survived the crash. Uh, do that. I have a feeling we're gonna need it. Hayes, you better come with me. Did the whole background just pop in there or something? I, <laughs> I couldn't get over the fact that her jacket, like nothing was detailed on her jacket. What do we do now? We don't know what is happening on the surface of this planet. McDonald's, my boss, he sure didn't. We have to get in contact with someone if we hope to get out of this mess. I hate to rain on your parade, but the Otago shithoused. Even if it wasn't, how do we get out past those Cerberus platforms? Well, they'll stop a ship, but not a signal. If we create our own relay, perhaps we could broadcast from low orbit, just in case a ship passes by. You want to create a sort of satellite? We're not a pirate radio station, Deputy Administrator. Or we could contact Pharaoh Spire. Director Price needs to... You heard, to... Martinez. The relays on this rock could be down for good. You want to send a message? Get out and start walking already. There has to be something we can do. Maybe there is. But I'm not seeing it. So you're going to sit here and do nothing? Like hell. After what happened up there, regs are clear. We're on an alert footing. There could be a hostile biomorph loose on Lethe. So we've got civvies in danger and no way to contact them, right? What about Otago's short-range frequency receiver? Yeah, that could work. For now. That doesn't solve our broadcasting problem. We have to you warn the people... You find a way we can do that? Then maybe, maybe we can talk about making that happen. Until then, we save everyone we can. We're Marines. That's the job. That's the job. Get familiar with this ship. What's left of it, anyway? Base management. You are now in the USS Otago. The Otago crashed after the activation of the Cerberus protocol. Wonder who set that off? It will be used as an operational base for your Marines between each deployment. Let's go to Med Bay. Have a nice day, Deputy Administrator Hayes. I'm Administrator Hayes. I know. I don't want to seem unwelcoming, but I don't really have time to talk right now. A lot of Marines are hurting. Half my orderlies are dead, and the med bay's being held together with bailing tape. How many casualties are we looking at? Between the platforms and the crash? At 20. And that'll double before the day's out. There's another 10 unaccounted for in Hangar Bay 3, but the doors are decompression sealed, so we know how that'll go. It'll get worse still if I don't get back to it, so if you'll excuse me. Yes, sorry. Sorry. Wounded Marines recover in the med bay. Wounded Marine can be redeployed until they have can't be redeployed until they have fully recovered from their wounds. Select the wounded marine. Okay, and then we will put them in intensive care. It'll cost us one. You can assign a physician to a wounded marine to speed up the healing process. For each physician assigned to a wounded marine, the recovery period is reduced by one day. Assign a physician to the marine. Let's do that. This one's a priority. Understood. Alright, let's do it. Let's go Talk to the workshop. To Hey, new girl. Sorry, but I'm pretty busy right now. Crash buckled half the support bulkhead. That's all I can do to stop this place caving in. All right, I'll let you get on. Thanks. Well, that was that was short. Need a gun, administrator. Once functioning again, the workshop will allow you to unlock weapons for your marines. Weapons provide specific skills and increase damage done. That's a little blue arrow. All right, nothing, nothing much else to be done here. Let's go to the Bye lab. Now. Ah yes, the scientists, the most trustworthy Hayes. people in Wayland Utani. Tell you how glad I am to see another Wayland Utani face aboard. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Dr. Becker. The company assigned me to the ship in order to oversee trials of a new cryo sleep routine. But I can't see that happening now. Look at the state of my lab. Months of vital research gone. If I at least had power, I could salvage the backups. These brutes keep ignoring me. Perhaps you could... Sorry, Doctor, but they're not exactly friendly to me either. It's not about friendly. 
who holds higher authority? A Wayland yutani executive or your typical Marine? Where does half the USCM's funding come from? Who provides their weapons? Hmm? You might want to push them. I'm sure they'll back down. Thank you, Doctor. You've given me a lot to think about. Well, of course I have. Deputy Administrator Hayes to the bridge. Let's roll. Hayes, please report to the bridge. Stay safe out there. Thank you. All right. This is what the short range frequency receiver picked up. It's a distress message from a nearby colony. Oh no. You thinking what I'm thinking? We have to go there. See for ourselves. What? I feel for those people, but we're blind here. If we're to save anyone, we need proper comms. We got them. The Otago, Hunslet's dropship, our vehicles, my marines. They all speak the same language. Courtesy of the USCM comm system. That's not what it's I meant. It's a military decision, Hayes. Which means it's my decision. Those folks need help. Fine. <laughs> We're definitely the bad guys. Normally, I'd lead the squad and an officer would run oversight. You know, intel, tactical, from the ARC, our armored recon carrier. I can do that, but I need you to handle the rest from here on the Otago. Oh, I thought I wasn't military. Don't I know it. Listen, if I'm going to keep my people alive, I need someone with smarts for when mine falls short. If it helps... This ain't exactly what I signed on for, either. Welcome to the Colonial Marines. <laughs> That's just cool. <laughs> That's just cool. Alright, you can access the deployment panel from the command deck. Select the launch motion. Let, launch motion. That's uh, one deployment left. Let's do the launch mission. The following areas. Dead Hills? Okay, so we select our mission in the Dead Hills. We can see on the left there all the different objectives, data pads, materials, and Xenotech. I assume all that's important stuff. Once you select the mission, the information panel, yeah, we've seen all that. Cool. Understood. Let's build our Loading squad. Data. Marines, nice. Not exactly your most impressive bunch of... This dude's about 100. Okay, for the first mission management options are locked. Later, we'll select the Marines. We'll do edit modify equipment. Okay, if we can select names and change names, and you're watching this video and you want your name featured on a Marine, leave a comment down below. I think that's a good, a good way to start customizing my Marines. Uh, when departing for a mission, your squad can pick different supplies. Medical supplies can be used to heal Marines and relieve their stress. Tools are necessary for welding doors and other technical interactions. Okay. So let's add a tool medical supply. Okay, I see it now. We've got 20 of those. So we'll add one more. Oh, that's it. Unfortunately, we can only get two out of four. Oh, let's go. Everybody in the ARC, everyone. Let's go. Wait, that guy looked like he just got like smushed in the door. Marines, listen up. I know we're hurting, but we got us a go mission. We pulled in a partial signal from the settlement of Dead Hills. We don't know exactly what's happening there, but after what we've seen on Pioneer, we can't take any risks. We'll start by securing the landing control zone. From there, we'll take a look around, see what's going on. Keep your eyes open for survivors. Be ready for a firefight. Even a bad day can get worse. Even a bad day can get worse. Okay, standard recon. 
Get the perimeter gate open. Let's see what's going down in this burg. On it. Okay, everybody. I think that's a good place to leave this video. And make, leave, leave you wanting a little bit more. Thank you very much for watching. I appreciate you being here. Make sure you hit that like button. Obviously, leave a comment if you want to have one of the Marines named after you. And we will catch you in the next video. Bye. Thank you.